Hello, hello and welcome back to the show. And today we are continuing Heart Trek game and uh, the sad news is that we missed Greystone Cargo. I tried uh, to, when I loaded the game, basically it just poof and gone to the Vincliff. And I, want the, I don't want that, so let's wait just uh, like 30 seconds. Maybe the Southgate uh, Cargo will become a Greystone, if not... Then we'll see what we should do. Or maybe no, we'll see. And uh, I can hear trucks is like beeping. Like probably they want like... Yeah, I cannot see. Not probably, yeah. No, no, there is nothing, so... I don't care. And the Southgate cargo will change to... Greystone. Perfect. Let's do this. Okay, I have a... Nothing else can be better than this. It will be a very huge challenge to do this because I, I have trailer. I need to use this uh, crappy uh, mines. Woodhill, Windcliff. Uh, Sandy Ranch and uh, Greystone, 27,000. So let's do this. I am second place. Basically my uh, plan of uh, attack is uh, to do this very carefully and gently and uh, not fight at all with my opponents. If they want like uh, overtake me, I will let them to do this because what's point uh, to get uh, accident or something. Okay. Let's see, and let's go! Okay, sadly there is no traffic light, so I cannot do anything. And my truck is already sliding, and I didn't even start doing anything. Nice! And if I succeed, I will get 27,000 money, and uh, I will have cargo back. And can I stop even? Um, I can. Okay, good. And this will be almost the last uh, thing what I need. Then I order a lot of drivers or I will do something at least. We'll see. So cotton isn't uh, very fragile cargo, but once again, it's uh, I'm with a trailer. And trailer makes like whole new challenge for me. And uh, the best way to do this with a trailer uh, to be very gentle and especially in the mines if you miss uh, like road or something that's it basically you cannot like uh, back up because camera angle will be stupid all you have this one mirror it will be very difficult to recover so I'm not recommending do the, doing this like in the first uh, run first you need to unlock this map Go to Greystone at least with a normal car, and then you can do this. And of course, the normal rules going with a trailer. You need to be careful with the, you know, turning angles, especially when there is a beginning at the ending of mines, these 90 degrees turns. And everything else is just normal trailer, trailer rules, basically. All you need is just be careful. And not get caught and I'm not even worrying about oh because you see nothing is damaged and uh, I now have all full marks for my trailer good we have four drivers already and of course they will overtake me I'm not even arguing about that they will do this and uh, be careful very careful when overtaking other drivers because they can be kamikazes because they don't care about you driving how you driving they just care about themselves and be very careful about big trucks because if you crash into them or they will crash into you, you are screwed. So basically this is like normal cargo, nothing special. Just very uh, profitable. Wow, this chopper is moving interestingly. I thought it will say something for me. 
So this is only first part uh, you need to be like worrying because here there's opponents and they can uh, basically ruin your day because so all them need all they need is just uh, hit you a bit a little bit then you lose the trailer or the this is the probably the best case scenario the worst case scenario your cargo will be damaged and uh, your day will be ruined basically and yes be very careful about jumps if you do depending where but the wet wood is the most profitable destination you can go from yep and he's not even allowing me to like like let him he is doing brake checks checks on me good it's up to him so i will do a refuel i will leave up again opponents at place because they will go to the fuel station they will probably crash into it or even into me another scenario they can wait for me so we'll see which uh which of them will happen yes they overtake me i don't care honestly there is another opponent that is stuck to me you see this is dri driving out of the fuel station is the most difficult part because they don't they, the cars is not leaving you space Yeah, now finally I can drive. It's very difficult because they're usually stuck in like piles behind you. And when you are moving it's fine, it should be fine. Of course there is another option like to refuel in the desert because there is spaces. And uh, when you start like going to quarries they can refuel. But there is more expensive fuel. Like, I prefer to do this a bit more dangerous way. And even, you know, it's like doing this is more fun because basically I'm doing this for a video and for viewers is more fun. So let's try to cut corner like that. Of course drifting is taking place. And this corner will be difficult again. Why? Because I know it will be difficult. Because it, this trailer will try to kill you. But hey, I fixed my car and... Uh, I'm getting close to quarries, that means I'm getting close to finish. And uh, if I succeed, the money reward will be really good, because basically I will, I'm now getting 27,000, right? And basically I will get the same, so basically 50,000 uh, from uh, going to Greystone and back. It's really profitable, if you not screw up. And if you have a DAF that is like uh, 2,000 tons more, it's even better, the bigger money. So it's even bigger reward doing this. Everything is about money here, so you need to be just careful. And yes, my opponent starting to basically pressure me. And this is very predictable at this stage, before quarries. And uh, usually what I noticed, opponents try to go with the quarries, like last time I did. So just be careful when, when and if you play in this game. Yeah. So one last hill and uh, basically quarries is, is, is close. And uh, when you reach quarries, it's, the danger isn't over. Oh no. Then it's the biggest part is like driving very caref carefully and not crashing into the mines itself or not get hanged in the mines itself because it's very easy to do that. Okay, so one of the last corners and hopefully they will not hit my trailer when I start turning and uh, we'll see. Okay, so let's go. This is it. We are starting our beautiful journey into the quarries with a trailer. It's an uh, extra challenge because with normal truck it's very easy. With a uh, trailer, ooh. especially it will be very difficult to go up uh, into the, into the uh, quarries because it will be like 90 degrees uh, turn with very difficult uh, corner. 
is going up and very sharp. So, yeah. So I will not use this one. I will try to use as maximum, uh, the maximum what I can use. Okay, this is the entrance. The first one. Yes, I'm very slow. Yes, you need to be in this part. In this part, you need to be very careful because if you go, uh, let's say, go, go down, it will be very difficult for you to recover. So the slower you do, I think the best will be for yourself. And let everything go very low, very like gently. Don't push anything. Like. Make as much uh, time here as possible, because if you're doing the quarries, you will get reward. Unless you screw up. This is it. The biggest uh, corner, 90 degrees turn in the quarries. It'll be fun. So, again, do this quick, I mean, uh, slowly. Just don't rush anything, and you will be successful. Now, you, when you are in quarries, the... Things will be much easier. Going to the Greystone, it's more uh, simpler because basically uh, it's going uphill. So you, you basically always slowing down, and with the engine, you just making yourself quicker uh, or slower, or just keeping up the, up the speed. And if you're going too fast, you just let out g uh, gas. But when you're going downhill, it's a much different story because basically you need break all the time and that is another challenge but that will be for the next episode and not for this because why make a very long episode i think it's good enough uh, to make like this and yes i will discover a new road that is nice i guess So if you have any suggestions about new games or something, let me know, like in comments below, because I'm trying to always discover uh, new stuff what I can uh, record. Maybe it, I, will fi I will find something fun. I'm planning to maybe try Farm Manager. I don't know, I never played this, uh, this type of game, uh, so I, I don't know what can I say about it, so I will try. Maybe if I do like this game, then I will record for you, so you'll see. And yes, always drive the most comfortable path. It will lead you to better things. And with the map, it will be much, much easier to drive here in quarries. And 90 degrees turn is coming. So I need to slow down, because then I need to turn very sharply. So once again, try slowly, just turn, just turn slowly. I don't know what happened, something glitched, but luckily game didn't crash. And then another turn, and uh, soon we will be out, so the most difficult part will be over. Then it will be just not crashing anywhere. Uh, you see, my trailer wanted to go straight. Then it will be the most difficult part uh, with jumps. Because it will be a lot of uh, open area and it will be very easy to jump with the trailer. And when you're jumping with trailer, you can just accidentally like hit it. Uh, hit the ground and then basically damage your cargo. You don't want that. You want all of this beautiful money for you. And yes, dust is not helping at all. <laughs> That's for sure. And without map, it will be interesting. We'll see. So, the best, <laughs> really, the best is, uh, the slower you go is the best. Okay, I'm getting close to the water, I can see. I need to be very gentle with myself. Okay, I did it. And yes, always use a uh, tutorial if, if something is going bad, because then you can turn sh more sharply. But in quarries and the uh, desert, it's better to be safe. 
and not really rush that much because look my opponents is not not even in the eastwood so you have so many time so much time to finish this don't, really don't rush when you're going to greystone and yes, be careful about upcoming traffic, because from this point there will be more traffic. A little bit more. And uh, when saying congratulations, you are first. That means your opponent is speeding up really fast. So, you know, you need, again, think. Not be too slow, but in my experience, they, they never catch me. So, you know... You have a lot of time, basically, to do this. And without map it will be very difficult, basically. Okay, it's very slow. And uh, our destination is very close. It's getting closer and closer. It's almost to that point. Oh, this is bad. I cannot see things, so <laughs> yeah, this is another uh, point of going to desert, because you cannot see stuff, basically, you're just driving blindly sometimes. Okay, basically if you have option, crash into car or, or uh, like, kill yourself, uh, basically crash into car, because uh, there is no police. So usually you get away with crashing. In this point. And I don't know, they have cooldown or something because uh, basically there no, is no cooldown because you are in Windcliff, I'm guessing in Windcliff like country lane, and uh, the foothill has uh, Mercury, I guess, or River, probably Mercury, I'm guessing. Maybe Southgate or whatever, basically. So this is the last corner. Mm. It's dangerous because it does have very small bumps. So when you're driving, just be careful. No, don't go too crazy, like no more than 80, because these small jumps can make a very big uh, jump, and then your trailer will be flying, and then cargo is damaged. And it seems we successfully did it. So, yeah, nice. And we have this nice money. Okay, so I guess it will be it for us. So thank you for watching. If you do like this video, don't forget to click like button, subscribe to this channel and share our videos with your friends. And uh, it will be it for us and see you next time.